Hi everyone, in this short video tutorial I will show you how to remove dust spots from your photos in Lightroom and in Photoshop. So let's start with Lightroom first. Here I have a photo which I took to a damaged ND filter so it has a lot of dust spots and it was also at F22, so even more dust spots. And I'm here in Lightroom, so let's look here and you can see the dust spots here. And to remove them, I can use the spot removal tool in the development module, spot removal tool. When I click on it, I choose the size, maybe smaller, and then I click on a spot and it will choose another area from where to remove it. This works, but it's a little bit hard to see where the dust spots are because yeah, you don't see them. To make it easier, you can go down here, down in on the left and choose visualize spots. If I click on it, you now see the picture changed and you can see the spots like up here, down here. So I can continue removing them in this mode. And when I'm done, I just click this back and I'm on my normal screen with the spots removed. So this is how you do it in Lightroom. In case it does not correctly remove, you can just hold this and move it around to get the better result. Um, in Lightroom do it like this. If you go to Photoshop, I have the same photo opened. You see I have the same problem when zoom in. I can use the retouching tools. So under here, if you hold your left mouse button on the healing tools, you get the spot healing brush, healing brush tool and patch tool. All these three can be used. So let's start with the spot healing brush tool. What it does is does the content aware. You can choose here, the content aware is the best. And when you brush over something, it will use content aware to fill in the area. It's the same as if you selected the area, did shift backspace to fill and choose content aware. It's the same result. But let's undo this. So we have something to work with and choose the second tool, the healing brush tool. This one works more as the clone step tool where you have to choose your source area by holding the Alt key, click, and then you paint over the spots. Again, works really nicely. And the third one I will again undo. So we have the spots and the third one is the patch tool where you select what you want to remove and then drag it onto an area from which you want to use the clean space. So yeah, like this. Again, you can <clears throat> help yourself a little by making these dust spots more visible, similar to Lightroom, but a little differently. To do so, create a new adjustment layer down in the right, new adjustment layer and choose curves. You will get the new curves layer. Just click somewhere in the first half and drag up and then click somewhere in the last second half and drag down like this a little more. And now you see the spots become really visible. If I zoom in, you can see all the spots that became visible just with this little adjustment. If I hide it, no dust spots visible, almost none here. If I put it on, you see all the dust spots. Now, if I want to remove them, I just choose the layer not the curves layer, the normal layer on which are the dust spots. Zoom in, remove them, and then just delete this curves layer when I don't need him anymore. So like this, I can, you see it's uh, quite crazy, but you see all the dust spots with this applied. So you remove them on the background layer or on the layer where you have the picture. And then when you are done, just delete the curves layer. This is all for this short tutorial and see you by the next one.